Oh, I didn't see this part. Wow. Let's see. Oops. There's a pattern to this, I'm sure. Okay, so there's a way run, jump. Stop doing your second jump, you idiot. The time's different than I'm thinking. Stop doing your second jump, it's not high enough. What if I try getting him there? That'd be awesome if I could make that. So I'd have a lot of time, but it doesn't look like it's possible. Okay, I think I can see how to do this. And it's actually a jump. There, that's a jump. And I missed because I was afraid of getting hit. That's tough. Oh, I didn't see that at the end. Okay. Since that one goes down, we run, jump, fail. No, we're not supposed to fail. We're supposed to win. So this time it's obviously the guy who had some idea of how far into the game we were, based on the number of bosses. This game, I don't, even, I don't know how many bosses there are, are you kidding? I'm just playing it by ear. It's blind. I thought when you got the, it looked like you need three keys to get up the tower and that'd be the final area. Now we're gonna fight. Oh, I made it. If we're gonna fight those, is it gonna be obvious like Bowser or is it gonna be someone completely obscure? No, oh, I made that one. Now watch, we're gonna get through this Mario themed area and we're gonna fight I don't know, Ezio. Ezio at Tode de Frenze. Yes, I haven't played that game too much. What can I say? It's fun. Uh, I'm not even like focusing on the story. I'm I'm doing about 50% of the time just playing the story, and the rest of the time looking for codex pages and viewpoints. It's so much stuff to do. I actually feel compelled to get 100% in that game, which I probably won't. Cause I said to myself I was gonna get 100%. I'm just gonna find all 1,000 light seeds in Prince of Persia and. Guess what I didn't do? Uh, come on, this isn't that hard. It's super nuts. Uh, I should just stop talking. So every time I talk, I die. See? Ah, stop doing your fail jumps. So you never messed up his, his double jumping, then I would do be fine in this area. But of course, this is just like I want to do that guy in that respect, except even worse. Okay, not quite fast enough. I go faster. Okay. That's mean.
And some more Goombas. We're probably gonna have to do more Goomba hopping. Come on! Ah. I wish I could become a first try, but it makes you wait every time, which annoys me. I don't want to get through it fast, so I don't have to. Stupid fire sticks. Okay, I think you've worn out. The Mario area is welcome. Wait a second, who did that? Please, time a little better since. You gotta pay attention, gotta go now. Okay, I don't know if that'd work, but that would make it a little easier because I could actually think before jumping and remembering that there's spikes right through the next room. Wait for it. Ah, I waited too long. Come on. Just got grazed by that one. Ah, I forgot about it again. This is annoying. I don't like waiting for things like this. Seems like. And now the guy waiting for those moving platforms. When they're on the other side of the room, at the beginning of each level, you have to sit there and wait for it to come back and get impatient, and then you die. Like that. Ah, I slipped. Didn't mean to move to the right there. Those of you guys, you guys who are wondering, um, how I'm talking about having a game for Skullboy to play after I beat this, even though he already got his revenge, technically, even though this is his revenge for what I, I put him through, this game, is, so far, it looks like this game is about twice as long as my game, so he's, he's going to play a game for me. I'm not going to require him to beat it because all I'm going to say about the game is... I w wouldn't be surprised if he couldn't beat it. I haven't even really attempted it, so I don't know if I could beat it, but... Anyways... Okay. Darn it, don't slip off! Move more to the right, but not. See, that's why I keep moving to the right, because I keep getting get hit. Then I'm fine. Ah, okay. Stop failing the double jumps. You can hear when you. You can hear your second jump has different sound effects, so you can tell when you do the wrong kind of jump. Alright, I forgot. Board. <clears throat> ah, I forgot to jump. So I'm just repeating the same deaths over and over again. This is not entertaining to you guys. So I'll probably end up cutting this out, but maybe I won't depend on, you know.
just got this chance to record again. Oops. Wasn't paying attention. Fire stick pattern is really messed up. I just realized something. Is there a point to going back? So you go back and you end up in pretty much the same exact position. You jump to avoid a fireball. Wait, can you do that? Let's try that. I just thought of something. Hang on. I'll show you guys. Let's jump. Nope. I'm thinking like maybe if I'm fast enough then I can jump through this before those fire sticks actually get into position. And those two fire sticks on the end. Darn it. I would actually jump normally like you're supposed to, instead of using my second jump when I'm trying to use my first jump. Ugh, come on. This is really messed up timing. This is really messed up timing. I'll spend the time. Come on. Stop using your second jump. It's always right there, too. Oops, no, I don't want to jump under it. Can't jump that far, I don't think. So those not go on to the next screen. They don't have to move so far to the right. I do this just right. No, not like that. Okay, I got can't use my I have to do my second jump though. But I can't use my second jump though, it's a big do, then I die. Okay. This is actually perfectly timed just screw you over. Oh yeah, we're playing out with the fan game. Come on. I'm tired of this game. I wanna play something else. This this game, I don't even know what part we're on anymore. We're in the 60s or 70s by now, and it just gets. I just want something. I'll play something new. Come on! I used my first job. Man, those are perfectly timed, aren't they? <laughs> I made it. Are you kidding? There's no save point in sight. Oh, there's mushrooms and all these. Those, there's a safe point in sight, but I have to go through that last one every time I die here. Uh, whose brilliant idea was this? This one's going to 
piss me off. It already has. Now the fact that I don't get a save point, that's just mean. After all that, I don't get a save point. Come on, I made that just fine. Well, let's figure out how to do this so it won't be as hard. I'm gonna go like this, jump back. As soon as you can pay attention. Okay, so jump here, here. Ah, stupid five, five, six, so well timed that it's ridiculous getting through this thing. That's right, you gotta save your second jump. So it's stupid. It's still better than fighting death, though. I just messed the whole thing up. Come on. I have nothing to say. I have nothing to say. I should probably just stop the recording until I get through. I'll have to start up every time I get there and then die, so I'm not going to. Come on! This is stupid. I just want to finish the Mario area. It's not too much to ask. Apparently it is. Okay. Now I see the problem here. Mm -hmm. That just as good as me as you hit those blocks, I think. Okay, I guess you can't land in between the spikes. Like good. But I was wrong. Run it. I hate waiting for this thing to go all the way around just so I can jump over it. I know it's, it's one of those things that the programmers didn't intentionally, I just know it. Come on. Where's my second jump? I thought my first jump was my second jump again, which means that I missed that area up even though. I didn't. One of the reasons why I don't have double jumping in I'll be the star. That and it's a little bit easier to control the their maximum jump height with just a single jump. Okay. So bounce on this one Goomba's head all the way to the end. Okay. I bet those oh I know why you can't step on uh you can't step on step on those because they release mushrooms as soon as you step on them. Because I have to use this platform which is being blocked by mushrooms, which is kind of unfair. Come on. That's not fair. That's really unfair. He's just gonna be patient when I get there. At least that next one actually isn't that bad. It's just this that's stupid. Even this once you get used to it, I think I'm kind of getting used to it. It's still, it's still annoying getting through it every time. I'm getting barely nicked by the fi fire sticks. They're just a little bit too long. See, those last fireballs, if these were one fireball short, shorter each, then I could 
I would have finished there a long time ago. But it's just long enough to screw it over, over at the end. See, I would made that. <sighs> Forgot, it's, these things are just a little bit too long. This is how first area wasn't as bad as it looked. This is worse than it looked, but it's still not horrible. Darn it, forgot about that. Jump, jump, jump. Darn it. Spinning fire stick, jump, jump, jump. Okay. Let's try this again. I missed. I missed the Goomba. I still have nothing to say because this is not very interesting. It was interesting at first, but then now that the Mario theme is starting to wear, his novelty is starting to wear off. I hope we won't have any more Mario after this. Just because, ultimately, well, it's actually new. Come on! Stupid fire sticks are too long. I also made that last time, too. I hit like every block, and I doesn't even matter that I hit every block because I got screwed over by a block that blocked me. You get it? Yeah, I don't have anything to say. Nothing funny. Nothing even interesting. Unless you're interested in the fact that my eyes feel like they're gonna start bleeding. I keep staring at the screen any longer. It's getting hard to concentrate. Stupid fireballs. Nope, gotta save your double jump a little bit later. Otherwise, they screw you over. Stop it. And then jump in, jump. Come on. Super fire sticks require perfect timing. If I go too fast, it's not like you have to go as fast as you can. You have to if you go too fast and you get killed. Anyways, so it's not like you can't go too. It's possible to actually go too fast through this area, and also it's possible to go too slow through this area. Try this again, and darn it, too early. I need a safe place to stand until you get through the sealer. Stop dying on that stupid... See, fire sticks too long in my opinion. 
the perfect length to screw you over not where you're standing. Okay, I got it. Wait, I can stand on the... Actually, I think I can stand on some of these platforms because they've already been used. Here. Oh, great. Here come the mushrooms. Kind of unfair. I didn't want to speak right now. I just want to get to the next area so I have something to, to at least talk about. Or talk about everything that's new with me. Well, I guess not, but I don't think I should here to listen to my life story. I'm here to watch me die over and over on the same traps. And then skip ahead to the next video or that. I just skip ahead and one minute to see if I've actually made it past or anything, you know. Look at that, hitting those blocks that you can walk on them if there's no mushrooms on them. Wonder if that's good or bad though. It's better to have a lot of mushrooms or. Or a place to walk safely so you can brown the mushrooms. I don't know. Come on. I put the, with their spikes up there too. With their hidden spikes in every one of those blocks, which means as soon as I get there, I'm gonna get hit by them and I'm, I'm gonna get angry. No. There's too many mushrooms. This two platform screws up the mushrooms so they don't just go on the nat natural paths. I'm gonna perform a little bit higher so the mushrooms aren't an artifact there. Nope. Come on. Stop it. This area is you lose all your awesome points for that death. So you're back to this game is back to its original status of I hate it. And it's not worth playing more than once. In fact, it's not worth playing at all. It's just that I was requested to, and I have to finish this. And I will not. I will not give up. Let's go ahead and give up on my game. I'm not going to give up on this game. It's probably a lot. You know, I, it seems like it's a lot harder. And definitely it's longer. Someone who's played this game at least tell me how far into the game I am in the comments. Just say, am I halfway? Am I almost there? I'm halfway, only like halfway right now. Maybe I'll take, I'm not gonna give up, maybe I'll take a break on it. Maybe I'll stop playing it for a little while, do my next let's play, and then come back to this. And I'll be hanging over my head until I do it. I jump to earth there. Come on. I'll 
but there's a lot of desync by now, so I should probably my die again. Nah, hang on, I'm gonna make sure there's no desync. Okay, we're ready to go again. Those last two fire sticks, they're pla placed just perfectly so that you can't get through them unless you have the most perfect jump that you can make. That's the time jumping through them just right so that you don't hit them on the way through, like that. Come on! Jump a little bit too far to the right. So much it's a good idea to hit. I'm trying to hit every single mushroom block. So I think it would help actually took care of the uh, blocks at the beginning, so I have somewhere to stand when I get to the end of it. You guys, I think you guys know what I'm talking about. If not, then you'll see. So I'm gonna try it next time. It won't matter because I'm probably gonna die on the spikes, because the Goomba jumping will fail. Too early. I need to stand there. So like an idiot, like, uh, what do I do next again? Oh yeah, don't die. I hit these blocks over here. Trying to get these blocks cleared. Watch it. Dang it! <sighs> you guys see I'm trying to do that, right? I'm trying to clear the... Clear those mushroom blocks so I can stand on normal grounds there. So I'm probably going to still the platform to jump high enough. You know, in this game. Darn it! I'm trying to use the platform because the platform is stupid and it messes up the mushroom's movement. So if there's a mushroom, mushroom touches it, and you can't use the. Yeah, you get it. Kind of like that. Great, now I've got a whole bunch of mushrooms stuck over here. So the platform's making them all move towards me. If I can get past this, though, then that area is almost completely clear. And now they're moving over there. Maybe that's actually for the best. Come on. Come on, please don't kill me. Please, please, please. Yes, I made it. Haha, finally. <laughs>